Shalom Lake, everyone. Yes. Shalom Lake, everyone. How you doing? Shalom. Or Shalom. Ahahidi. <laughs> yes, um, today, today I'm here to speak about the concept of about the, the two nations. Yes, about the two nations that the world that, where we was like very confused today, you know? And I'm going to say it, shall we? And we're going to talk about it, shall we? Now, do you remember? I know a lot of y'all read Chronicles. Where well, you read Chronicle. And also, Chronicle did talk about the nation of a sets, or two sets of group. Mean that we've been confused by race. We, you know, saying with the uh, with the black Hebrew Israelites say, say, oh, you know, uh, this is the uh, twelve tribes of Judah and this uh, from 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 Mexico, Judah or or Cuba and such and such or different type of Dubai title, no, and they wrong and that's incorrect. And I give respect to the Hebrew Israelites. I give respect to them. And I give respect to the other, other people out there also. They have their own words of opinion. But let's be realistic and honesty with the truth. This is not no confusing thing. It's only two nations. You have 12 tribes of Judah. And also you have Esau. You always have to remember between Jacob and Esau. Remember the word says that that Jacob, that God loved Jacob and God hate Esau. Yes, you remember that. Now, what's the difference between those two? Jacob are a people of color. Also known as Hebrew. Israelites, Jew, Jew, G, J, E, W. Forgive me, forgive me for using the word G. <laughs> and also the word Jewish. Now that's Esau side. Jewish. Meaning that they're not part of the 12 tribes. Now you got yourself a two nations. The two nations between those two fight each other. You all see between the two nations fight each other. To be honest, is Hebrew and Edomite. Why? A people of color and also red skin. And let me describe that for you. The 12 tribes of Judah, the 12 tribes of Israel, is is when you look at a person of color, you see a person is dark black, brown skin, like like how the Indian complexion. You got some of them very light brown. You got some of them really dark, dark brown. And also, we got a person also part of a person of color that's like, they call them red bone. And they look like they Edomite, but they're not exactly Edomite. They are known as a person of color. Now, Edomite is a person that's red skin, like you see every day, the one you call so-called Caucasian, white, but they're not even known as none of those titles. They are not known as none of those titles. They are known as Edomite. And Esau do have a family like, like Ammonites in all straight line, the whole nine yards. And you know he's a family to uh, Caesar Augusta. And yes, and also, he is part of it. Jacob have the 12 tribes. And now today, we so confused because we live in by divide. And that divide is turned around to be hate. That's why we had the one that call, call Hawaii or India or this and that. When you come around, you say, oh, I am I am from India, da da. But they never hear the word with certain race of themselves. Why is it like that? Because they want to divide. And when they divide, that's how smart that Edomites do. And when they divide, 
That's why it turned out to be conflict and hateful. Hey, let's be honest. The ones that worship the devil is the ones that still Tony B. verified known is Edomite. Did Caesar Gusser was a good person? No, he never been a good person. He was evil. And he's ahead of all. And now who controlling? Now who controlling in Rome in Rome today? The Pope. Hey, let's be honest. Now, the Jewish today, where they say the Jewish, right? The ones you see them wear black and white jacket and long curly tweezers. They say they supposed to be represent the 12 tribes. No, they're not part of the 12 tribes. No, they're not part of the 12 tribes. Let's correct it. This is not no discriminating thing. This is the truth. They're not part of the 12 tribes. They, I don't know why they're ashamed to call themselves Esau, that the children of Esau, they're part of the family of Esau. And I don't know why they didn't say that for all these years. But see, you been now you hear the truth. They are known as Esau. They was no they never been known as Jew. They was known as Jewish. Just be thankful you have that title. Jewish. You part of Esau. You're not part of the twelve tribes. You part of the Edomites. <clears throat> the part of the, the twelve tribes is a person of color. And let's speak the truth for that. If you check on Chronicle, chapter one, first, first Chronicle, first of Chronicle, chapter one, it tell you what's Esau children. If you check out, if you check out the twelve tribes in the Word, the Bible, the Torah, whatever level, it tell you about the twelve tribes. And yes. It did tell you about the two nations, because that's your two nations now. And that's the two nations they should describe it. But no one don't want to describe it. And that's the truth of, of that about ethnic. It's not about the Palestine, all that stuff, and all whatever around the world. What do you see? You see nothing but Edomites. If you look at the TV lately, you see nothing but Edomites. If you see what's, what's, what they say the biggest pioneer, Edomites. Only see less of people of color. And let's be honest, I'll be honest the truth. But in the word, in the word, Yahshua did say to love one another. And he's right. We gotta love one another. So today we don't even hate each other. But the truth will set you free. And I did check a lot of investigation of resource. Research, not resource. Research. And yes, it's only two nations. Hebrew Israelites, you did wrong with the two tribes, with the with the different nationality out there. Yes, there's a lot of different nationality out there, but it's also the 12 tribes are known a person of color, and Esau are nothing but Edomites, red skin. They've never been known as white or Caucasian. And to get it straight, you don't have to get mad at me for being honest. That's the truth. That people use the word today is a fact. Well, I go deeper than that. And I investigate that. And it's written, it's already written, it's already done said. It's already done said, it's already done told. Who's your identity? And those Jewish you see today, that own synagogue, they've never been part of the 12 tribe. But I could tell you they was under they was there in Egypt. The Kimazites. Remember one was follow follow on um, Moses? They never been known as part of the Israelites. 
but they've been respected. To be respected is they are not part of it. They was like under. And that's the two nations I want to describe to the whole world. And it's already been timeline. Yeshua is a person of color. And Caesar Augusta is an Edomite. And who does Caesar Augusta have to hate? Yeshua. Yeshua don't have no beard, you know. Mm -mm. He had long hair. Nice brown Indian complexion. Just like you look at India, the one that called untouchable. Look at that complexion. He's a person of color. And Caesar Augusta is an Edomite. And he part of the Esau family. And that's his children. And they never say nothing about that, but that's the truth. And I thank you. To let the whole world know we've been confused, we've been divided, we live by divide. And that's why we end up against each other, have no type of understanding. We've been we've been holding so long, the truth had to come out. And now I revealed it. I respect the nationality of all nations where they say, hey, I am Cuba, I am this and that. Okay, cool. But that's still divided. The mind's still living by divided. It's just like saying, what God you worship? Are you worship God of Yah, Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob? Do you believe Yahshua? Hamashiach, as known as Jesus is Messiah. If you don't believe, then you know who you are. The real Most High is a Jew, a person of color. Jewish is Caesar Augusta. And oh, they don't like to see a person of color to be happy. No, they really don't. And that's what Caesar Augusta did. You have to remember Paul say himself, he's a Hebrew. He said he's a Jew. And our real language is Aramaic, not Yiddish, not Palito. And that's what's making so confusion today. Esau speak Yiddish. And it's hard to believe. Amen. Thank you. And that's the truth. That's the worst, and the worst actually expose it itself today. Shalom for your language. Semle to everyone. And don't get confused. Because that divided word, it never been exists. But only thing is is this is the twelve tribes and between Jacob and Esau with two nations that's fighting each other today. And two nations that's carry the the issues. Mm hmm One nation's carry the issue that Esau always wanted. You should know, because it's already saying the word. And that's why he treat. That's why he wanted to kill Jacob. And that's why he doing that. And to this day, 
Caesar Augusta did what he had to do with Yahshua. And that's the truth. Alright? Salam le. And don't get confused with it, that divide foolishness. Because everybody around the world, all you see is what? Color and Edomite. Red skin. Nothing else. If they treat you different, you know why. Alright? Salam le. And that's the truth.